any surveyed area, interpretation of various heat maps can provide further insight into the surveyed results. In this example, a signal strength survey of a floor plan is displayed with the predicted location of the access points as well as the channels that they are transmitting in. If the user goes to the options button, they will see a, quite a few parameters that can be modified which will be affecting the displayed results uh, in, in ECAHO site survey. The first one is the visualization mode, which can be turned to in detailed mode or smooth mode. Uh, this function basically uh, does the visualization based on polygon-based extrapolation, which is when we have the contours, or we can turn it off by just going into the detailed mode. Um, the next parameter is the uh, resolution of the uh, results in a smooth, uh, in the smooth visualization. Um, basically, the extrapolation amounts used to figure out the heat maps will affect the speed and the time and accuracy of processing the information. So a balance is required in this area. Furthermore, the results can be super accurate or it can be very accurate. And this result also for very large networks will define the time that it takes for the system to process the information and display the information and uh, it will affect the refresh rate. So users have to find the balance between uh, the uh, accuracy and speed that they require in order to process the information. The next parameter is the signal prediction. This is a very interesting topic itself. As um, everyone knows, it might not be always feasible for, for a user or a surveyor to uh, survey every single possible location within a survey area. In, in this scenario, signal prediction can be used to extrapolate the information and see what are the predicted results within the non-surveyed areas. Um, this uh, feature is available for both survey and planning modes. And in the survey mode, uh, once we turn this feature off, you can see that the results are further uh, a lot more accurate and the data is very accurate. Um, if we go to super accurate and change the resolution to one meters, we can see that these are the actual data points. Now, if this signal prediction is on and we modify the location of AP or the predicted location of AP to actual location, we can see that the uh, results, the predicted results changes accordingly and based on the location that this AP is selected on. However, if we turn off the signal prediction, as we move around the same access point, we can see there is no change in the obtained results because these are the actual results that we um, have. The next parameter, which becomes very important and it's a very interesting one, is uh, the adapter itself. Uh, as, a, as it is obvious, uh, different adapters uh, vary in terms of signal strength measurement and receiver sensitivity values. Uh, users can visualize various metrics from the eyes of the selected network adapter. For example, if you were to deploy for voice over IP, you can visualize how a wireless voice over IP phone would see the network. Simply click and select the voice over IP phone. And you will see uh, how the network is seen from the eyes of that uh, adapter itself, uh, which is a very powerful feature. But by default, we display the uh, raw measurements. The next parameter, which is important in the options, is basically the results that are displayed, which is by default strongest. Now, users can change to second strongest or third strongest. And uh, this result uh, basically shows uh, various scenarios where the best serving AP or two of the best serving APs are not used. So 
should it be the third one we can see the results of the third one uh, and the final parameter that can be modified is uh, the channels and sometimes it is important for the for the users to uh, that they want to see um, uh, visualization based on selected channels and uh, the, these uh, signals of the channels limit the signal strength visualization to only show signal at the selected channel and simply users can select a specific channel and then they can see the results of this channel uh, in conclusion as you can see um, options is a very important uh, segment of the e-commerce site survey which would show different results based on different settings that the users will be uh, selecting thank you for watching